They explained to me that that was their pet. I thought it was a show animal. I had no idea that it was a pet, and it was a huge, gigantic snake. Oh, wow. One of those oh, great, those. big, gigantic snakes. And you never know what can happen with those great, big, gigantic... You just went for candy. You never know what can happen with those great, big, gigantic snakes. Anything can happen at any time, those great, big, gigantic snakes. Most people, when they take them, they take them, and they hold them, and they enjoy it. And they go ahead, guys, and they do so many different things. But you know what's amazing about some animals, some pets? You love them so much, you don't do anything to them, and you're very careful with them, so you have them for a very, very long time. Some pets, <laughs> okay? That's how you treat some pets. Does anybody want to? How many in here, how many in here have had a pet hamster before? A uh, pet me. hamster. <laughs> I'm going to share you guys a story about my pet hamster really quick. Have a seat, guys. Everybody have a seat. Everybody have a seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. Okay. Listen up to this really quick. How many love their hamster? Absolutely love their hamster. You think your hamster... I'm going to share you a story about a hamster. I had a couple different hamsters in my life. One that I loved. One that I... I'll be honest with you. I hated. Do you know why? This hamster was a vicious, mean hamster. This hamster showed its teeth to me. And I remember we thought nothing of it. And I go ahead and I reach my hand down in there because we got to clean out that hamster cage. And I reach it down and I remember going ahead and going to pull it back out. And guess what that hamster did to me? It bit you. It bit me! Why are you smiling? The hamster bit me. Blood started coming out of my finger. I was like, oh, oh. And my brother's like, ha, 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 ha. He's just laughing at me. I was like, you trying to get the hamster. So guess what happened? What do you think happened? My brother goes ahead, reaches his hand down the roof. Ah, okay. Why? Why did we not learn from our failures? I'll be honest with you, I hated that hamster. When that hamster died, when that hamster kicked the bucket, I, no, 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 and then I shed no tears. I didn't cry. I didn't do anything. They're like, hey, the hamster died. Okay? I was not that upset at all. And can I share you, I had another hamster that I remember picking up, guys. And this hamster was the cutest, cuddliest thing. You could put him on the floor and he'd run around a little bit. And then he'd always come over to you, that little nose. And like, he wanted you to pick him up and hold him. He was one of the most adorable. It was almost like a cat. Cat and a hamster. Okay, that's a good combination. But that's what his fancy like. He even enjoyed, he would enjoy, enjoy sometimes. You guys all know those hamster balls? He loved the hamster ball where the, the little hamster would go inside of that ball so nothing could hurt it. And he'd love to play with the cat. And he'd roll the ball up the cat and go forward and back and hit the cat a couple times so the cat started playing with him and started batting him around. It was the most amazing thing. When that hamster died, I cried. Why? Because that hamster was like a real pet to me. That was something that was very important. And let me share something with you guys. Sometimes, guys, we take good care. We take good care of our pets. Okay. Sometimes, guys, we take really good care. Sometimes, some of the pets that we have, we shouldn't take good care. Do you know there's a story, true story, of somebody going ahead and keeping alligator as a pet? Do you think that's a good idea? No. It's actually illegal to do that, okay? It's not a good idea. I have heard stories of having... Now, how many here are cat lovers? I'm a cat lovers. Okay, so I won't tell you too mean stories, okay? <laughs> but, I'm going to share this with you. There's a story about this cat. Nice kitty, kitty. Nice kitty, kitty. And all of a sudden, the cat... Ah! went off on this older lady 
lady, and I'm not lying when I say this, the lady got put in the hospital because a cat attacked her that bad. And a lot of you are going, oh, who's dead? Really? Yeah, really. A cat that attacked its own. Ah! You know, that's what it did to the owner. Can you imagine? Can you imagine what it was like? Can you imagine what it was like, guys? When that cat attacked its owner, do you think that cat was sorry for what it did? No. Do you think the owner was sorry for having the cat? No. Let me share something with you guys. This is your pet. Okay? What do you guys want to name the pet? Now I can see this being 
there, animal princess. <laughs> but anyways, alright, so we got princess guys. Princess gets a little older. Gets a little bigger. Oh And princess um is starting to develop some teeth. Um, and princess, the older princess gets, you know what else comes along with princess? The uglier princess gets. <laughs> the uglier princess gets. So now, I'm holy princess, like this. Everybody see princess? No. Ooh. Okay. And they're starting to notice princess isn't this beautiful little animal that we once thought it was. Yes, it is. Matter of fact, princess is the princess of close to ugly. No. So, Princess gets a little older, gets a little bigger. Oh my god. Okay? That's who I is. Oh my god. And Princess, now it's like, hey everybody, do you see Princess? Is it Princess Q? No. Yes. No. no. Is that a good thing? No. Do you think that's fun to walk around with an animal like this that looks like a dust buddy with teeth? Or you just walk around with it. Okay, it's scary, okay? And you know what? The owner, instead of going ahead and saying, bad princess, you can't eat this much. Bad princess, stay out of the garbage. It just lets it do whatever it wants to do. Let's it roam its life and lets it go ahead and go on throughout. I gotta bring up the story because I'm gonna hit time restraints here pretty soon. But princess, And Princess even has ears now. But, oh my God. Princess like is now the <laughs> ugly, ugly Princess. Oh, no, it's, no, it's so no, ugly. No, so no. now you go to school with Princess and everybody's like, hey, what are you doing with that? Get that out of here. But, but, I, and, and show and tell. I want to show my Princess. Look, is the Princess cute? Oh, yeah. Okay. And everybody thinks it's the ugliest looking animal ever known to mankind. Who would agree Princess is ugly? Yeah. No. Who would agree Princess is a bad name? No. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so we got Princess. I, I tried to change the name up for him. But no. Okay, no. but we got Princess now, guys. And Princess now, we're walking around with Princess like this. Oh, nice. Okay, nice, nice. What are you? Okay, Princess is no longer a nice little animal. We missed the days when Princess was like this, and we think Princess in the palm of her hand, and oh, and now all of a sudden Princess is like that, okay? Well, more time passes. Don't suck. And Princess... Oh my gosh! He's giant! That's not Is now all of a sudden... Hi, Princess! Oh, I love you! <laughs> I've always liked you. Can I roll you? <laughs> princess! Food! Whoa! Oh, got me! And you start realizing Princess is out of control. Princess is not so good anymore. Princess is a big fat blob of a princess. Big fat blob of a princess. We don't even know what Princess does. Princess is so confusing now. Everything about Princess, the, it's like, it's like Princess is developing horns. It is, he ate the nose down here. <laughs> Alright, but Princess, guys, has had it. Well, the nose is a he. It's a he. Princess, no, 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 that's it, that's it. Okay. Princess now is so large, so big. It's like, what are you gonna do with Princess? You gonna roll it? Uh, maybe you could kick it. Better not do that. Okay, don't know what to thing. You don't know what to do with Princess. You have no idea. You know, maybe if I put it in somebody's house. Oh, I'm sorry. All right, but Princess, it looks more like a cross between a pumpkin 
Oh, and a cat. Oh, yeah. And, oh, yeah. and, and dead aim alongside the road. <laughs> Princess is no longer cute anymore. Can I share something with you? Listen up to me very closely. I'm going to get right in the lesson here. So I don't have much time. My lesson, the, the, the practical part of this is really quick. Daniel, just go ahead and let me sit there, okay? Right now. I want you guys to stop and think about this for a little bit. And stop and put this in realization. We do this in our lives all the time. People have pets that get out of control, and they keep them, and they don't want to get rid of them, and they say, oh, everything's going to be just fine. Don't worry about my pet. Can I share something with you guys? Listen up to me very closely. Listen up very closely. Another good name. It's Princess. Yay! It's a dirty princess. Who knows what the actual name of this illustration is? No, Ugly Devil. 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 Sid. And then Dirt Can I share something with you guys? Listen up to me very closely. Please, Avery, listen. Okay? This is very important. This is what we do with sin, guys. We get sin at first and we're like, ooh, look. Stealing from mom and dad. Oh, I can get away with it. No big deal. Oh, look. I can do this. I can do that and get away with it. Oh, look. I can disobey my parents. Oh, look. I can go ahead and be mean to somebody at school. Oh, look. And as time goes on, guys, at first, it's a little kindergartner, a little kid going, no, to their mom and dad. And some people can say, oh, isn't that cute? You know, as the kid gets older, Things can change, don't it? A lot of things can change. In James 4, 17, listen up this verse. It says, Therefore, to him that knoweth the good, and doeth it not, to him it is sin. Let's go ahead and pray. Let's pray. Father, I thank you, Lord God, so much today. I pray, Father, we'll start to get in here uh, to be able to understand the lesson clearly. Help you, Father God, the short time we have left to make it something that the... Uh, They'll be able to take home with them. Do you, Father God, never forget this lesson. In your name, amen. You know what one of the biggest things, guys, I remember I battled with my whole life? Hold on. You know one of the biggest things, guys, I always battled with my life? Was this. Listen, guys. Eyeballs up here. Hey, buddy. Pay attention up here. Eyes up here. One of the hardest things I had to deal with in my life, to be completely honest with you, in my Christian life, was figuring out know, what was wrong and what was right. You know what the, the Bible says? Therefore, to him that knoweth the good, knoweth it not to him that is sin. There are some things in the Bible, guys, that you know is wrong to do. Some of you guys in here know that it's wrong to talk when a teacher's speaking. Right? So what do you still do? Some of you in here know it's wrong to go ahead and cheat in school. Some of you in here know it's wrong. Hey, guys. Nope. Okay. Some of you know it's wrong to go ahead and do those things. Some of you guys in here know it's wrong to go ahead and use a bad word. Amen? But guess what? You still do it. Why? Because this is like that little pet. That pet sin that you have. That thing that you don't want to get rid of. That thing that you want to go ahead and keep and love and hug. and Oh, I love you. But can I share with you guys? No. That pet sin gets out of control. Okay? If you don't get it under control, guess what's going to happen? It's going to take you over. Do you ever watch somebody when they go off and walk a dog? But they're not really walking the dog. The dog is walking them. Okay? In the beginning, sin, let's be honest, guys. How many in here? Now, I'm not looking for a show of hands. But I think you guys know this. How many in here have actually <laughs> killed somebody? Okay, you murdered somebody? Oh, okay. All right. I just wanted to catch you on that. But, guys, but how many here, in all honesty, don't, don't, don't raise your hand on this then, but how many here, in all honesty, think about it yourself, have ever disobeyed your parents? Okay. I want you guys to stop and think about it. Is that right or wrong? It's wrong. So you know what's right, you know what's wrong. Is it okay to lie? Is it okay to lie? What's the Bible said? Thou shalt not lie. So is it bad to lie? It is. Is there any circumstance where it's okay to lie? No. Lying isn't a good thing, guys. Lying gets you in a lot of trouble, but guess what? 
Yeah. If you tell one lie, guess what you're more likely to do? Lie. You're going to tell another one because you got to tell another lie to cover up that lie you just did. And it's going to keep on coming and rolling that way. I don't want everybody in 